you with you, Vinzi? Sure. He's going to take you to the like center. Um, Help yourself to like a, a petty operation. Oh. Oh. <laughs> he lots just on his work experience, right? This guy. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> that was a lad that was speaking to from offshore. Um, back in the back in the days, right? Fight me. Go get a wee photo. Laugh at me. Nah, he's laughing at me. Fight you. Are you dribbling? <laughs> I just like Tom. Fight you. 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 So, I was eyeing up the Milwaukee fan because one, it's a nice colour red and uh, it's very powerful. And then the nice people from Milwaukee handed me a fan. So now I can go to World Shores, man, and all the hot countries and stay cool with the Milwaukee fan. I'm hoping she answers. I'm praying she answers because she's in working tent because she shouldn't answer her phone. Hey. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. How you doing? <laughs> that's, that's a wee boy, Kyle. Oh, hey, Kyle, you alright, mate? Hey. Where are you hiding? He's hiding. He gets nervous and shy. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, bless, lad. He's crying. <laughs> He's scared I'd, of me. I'd cry if I saw Tom as well, man. I'd cry if I saw Luke. We'll, we'll speak to you soon. You take care now. Bye-bye. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Cheers. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> 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 that will have made her day. Thanks, guys, very much. This hasn't been touched since the 90s, though. Fifty shot classic. What you got? Yeah. Come. Come on, Come. This is the restock of the, the Trust Me Will Survive T-shirts. So fortunately, they're they were only out of stock for a couple of weeks. Uh, the first release of them went really well. People people seem to really like them. So. We, uh, we wanted to time in another restock as soon as. Yeah, um, so hopefully these go go out as as well as the last. This is obviously a really special special design to us. It really means a lot that that people are are like buying into it. They they feel something when they when they see it. Um, and yeah, that's what we're trying to do here is is make something meaningful. It's off to the dump we go. <laughs>
We have got sour apple, my protein, pre-workout. You know what? I like this stuff. You know why? It makes you strong. So I take pre-workout uh, before the gym. I'll separate in the gym and I'll also take creatine if I can find another shake. Recap my training Friday, six events done. Did some log and axle and arm over arm, and uh, I did um, Conan's wheel pickups, dumbbells, and stuff like that. And then at the stones, I did the heavy at the stones. Two sessions back, already hitting a 250 kg at the stones. So, very good, trying to get as much training as I can. Strength still there, which is good. So, deadlift day, we're back to it. Um, you know, obviously, I've got to train for Royal Albert Hall and I've got to train for Shaw Classic. So, I'm trying to keep the suit off and uh, Go raw, so I think I'm going to bash out the axle today and see see what happens with that. But yeah, got a few things on this week. Going to go see a school for their uh, just to get me invited into the school in Cromarty. Cromarty is where we dot the Stopman Pizza as well at Suitors Creed, so we're going to have that as well. Tom, our camera guy, is going to try that, so that'll be cool. We're going to the Nern Academy for the sports awards as well, and uh, that'll be quite cool. And then I'm away to WWE Thursday, Friday, Saturday, then off to the Euros uh, over in Munich for a wee while. So. It's gonna be good, but first of all, let's go get training done. Let me drink my pre-workout and let's uh, stay spicy. Walking into my Zumba class, and today we're doing the world's strongest hips. the first time deadlifting uh, since World's Strongest Man, so biceps still intact, which is good. So we're doing pause deadlifts, only at 200, but just being really conservative with, with weights. I'm trying not to do any rotations this way, because that's when I feel the pressure on the biceps, so that's it. Still here, still fighting. Yeah, so since World, um, obviously Luke got the diagnosis that he had a tear in his tendon. And in terms of the rehabilitation, it's, it's going quite smoothly. I spoke to him this morning and he said he's feeling a lot better and the ache that he was getting day to day has gone down, which is great news. At the end of the day, this is the career. They, they earn the wage from this, they earn the money, the prize money, and they rely on me to um, put just as much 
uh, in for them as they put into the sport. Human beings at this moment in time are the strongest they've ever been throughout history. And I get to train 10, 11, 12 of them. You can't learn that from a book. You can't learn that from studying. It's, it's new information, really, how people react and how strong these people are. As you can see, I'm with my wife, and we're going to eat breakfast, uh, lunch. And today, I eat, oh, lunch, a little bit of cheese and a little bit of tuna. Oh, quality, lovely. Lunch, tuna, cheese, potato. Oh, look at the little owls as well. Who's that? Is that, is that your first reading book? <laughs> I love you more today than I did yesterday. Yes, you were right, Nog. <laughs> it's very true. Look at these, mate. Tom, come get one of these. A surprise, I'll leave that place. 1,250. I collect whiskey, so I've caught. This, this one's the second one of these done where I've got the first one as well. They're really cool. But I didn't know there was a... I like expensive whiskey because it means it's going to be double the price. A hard life working for the stars. We're currently on the way to Luke's. There's a well I'll tell you actually it's Brass Monkey, so we've we're uh, we talked to Brass Monkey ages ago because uh, I just loved how they went down to zero degrees and the ice and all that on them and it's been couriered up and it was stuck in the Vernets all last week. Get a phone call Tuesday morning, it's up at Luke's. So this tub is six hundred and fifty kilograms. There's four strong men. Let's see how much disaster we bring to this. I may be the not the smartest stopman, but I knew how to do that. Eh? Yeah, yeah. No, this is mine. Yeah, the boys don't realise that. It's just double back. Jesus, yeah. that's From my, my aches and pains. Holy God. You could sleep in there as well, wow. Eh? It's proper. Steady, huh? Get your there. Sit in there and see what. All right. Just be your head. Get your hat on, mate. That's proper called that tub.
I think everybody knows I talk about Luke with a lot of positivity, a lot of love, and Luke's an unbelievable brother, but also an unbelievable athlete. He's the one that paved the way into strawman for myself. He's the one that pulled me out of my room at 16 years old, where I was going in really dark places and said, come to the gym, and it involved me into who the guy I am today. So yeah, big love to Luke, massive respect to Luke. And I talk so much about my family. My mother passed away in 2016. She was my biggest supporter. She never ever gave up on me. She kept on fighting for myself. She kept on making me a better human. And she did a lot of things that, you know, I wish I could thank her for. She was, she came to every single competition of myself. She said to me, all I want you to do is be happy, get a wife, get a house and, you know, be successful. And I lived that promise is done. And she's been, she is still living in my soul. You know, I've got a tattoo of sunflowers, her favorite uh, flower. We always talk about her every single day. So she was a massive role model to me. But also got my wife as well, who knew who would die for myself. And, my family have been unbelievable to myself on this journey with autism, but also on this journey with Strongman as well. Like I touched on it as well, I think three times is halfway to being the greatest of all time, and I'm very hungry to be the greatest of all time. Marius Puskonovsky's won five trophies. Uh, that's not been touched. Obviously, Brian Shaw was next in line, but he's retired. So I really think I'm capable with the mindset I've got, with the hunger, touch with no injuries, with the age I am. I could be the most successful Strongman in the world, and. I want to be the most successful strongman in the world and that's the biggest goal for myself is just to keep on doing what I'm doing, keep inspiring people with autism, keep saying it's a superpower and just keep building my brand, my business and just keep putting you know, the highlands on the map 100% because there's so many talented people up here as we can see in our academy, the, all the people that have won the awards, there's so many talented people but they don't get talked about enough and that's what myself and Luke are trying to do is trying to find the next strongman, the next Olympian and build them up and really, really talk about them. Thank you, I'm here all week. There's all this primary school. I just went. Uh, I actually just went over to France to watch Taylor Swift and Leon, and I just uh, took my wife and my niece down to watch it in Edinburgh as well. So I'm a massive fan of Taylor Swift. So. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't for her and my brother, but for my family. Then I wouldn't be here. And, you know, family is very, very important. Favorite food. Um, burgers. <laughs> That's your favourite. Everyone loves burgers, don't they? Hello. 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 My best friend, uh, I seen you glow. I was like, I seen you in the corner, and all the kids turn around in the other week. <laughs> So it's venison, chicken, bacon, pork, uh, black pudding, what I'm putting on right now, and then buffalo mozzarella. It's a, it's a compact, a lot on it. And uh, just out of interest, has it been popular since you've had it? Very, on? very popular. It's probably top, I would say top three. Definitely top three. Did you like it? 
<laughs> yeah, this will beef him up for his uh, his next uh, activity, you know. Asking is true. Tom, presumably, Tom can eat this like it's a snack. Oh yeah, one bite for. Let's go around clubbing. Whack it in here. Takes about two or three minutes to cook. Very fast. How do you know it's done? Check the base here. Nice and crispy. Walk a little bit more on there. Master, 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 done. That's Tom Stolman. Look, this bit here is Tom Stolman. Now I, now I know why Sinead thinks I'm so tasty, because that is unbelievable. Look at the pizza, the way Sinead looks at me. So this is the pizza designed by myself and Luke that Tom hasn't tried yet. Taste test now. Let's do it. Here we go, salt and pizza. I feel like I have to like it. If I don't on camera, then I'm going to be in trouble. It's also roasting hot. <laughs> I think it's, it's really hot. <laughs> mm. Out of 10. Out of 10. Burning sensation 10. <laughs> Taste 9. 9. Oh. Needs jalapenos or something. Well, it just ruined Because these boys are spicy. Where's the spice? You know what I mean? Anyway, stay spicy, mother. It's like, that it's like, it's like going for food of a girl. I can't finish your meal. <laughs> So on that note, I'm going to crossfade to this pizza being eaten. <laughs> Unfortunately, all my plans are ruined, Sinead. No, not want to go on the ferry. My autism's playing a big up big time now. The plans is unbelievable. So, you know, if you get a wife, make sure she supports you. You just called out Sinead to stop it. <laughs> oh. Where are we at? That is, uh... <laughs> <laughs> the ferry's closed. Uh, the ferry's closed. Closed. So where are we going? We have to go waste our time at Fort Rose. Ski. Why are you taking the camera? Huh? You're taking the camera. Tom, this would be lovely in What I then yeah. said no Scots person ever. I'm English. If it was me for what the OL is, where would you be? <laughs> so you've turned this wise look stopping in this, not Tom stopping it. Is he actually oh, in this? That's bad. It's 999, sir. So because looks of it, it would be 199 if it was me Right guys, that is our fun filled week. Dan, you see me train, you see me do some talks, you see me do everything, you see me eat pizzas, you see me just be big time Stoltman. I am off to Glasgow to go to the WWE. I am making my debut as Tom Stoltman, the Albatross, to get the WWE Heavyweight Champion from Drew McIntyre. I'm, I'm going down as a special guest, do some things with Drew, go do some things with Rangers and just have some fun. Then I'm flying over to Munich on Sunday to do some things for the Euros until Tuesday. So it's going to be fun, filled, action packed weekend. We will see you on the flip side. Thank you for watching. Stay safe, smile, and uh, stay spicy.